Jensen! Oh, good. I'm glad I caught you. Remember that bombing you were in? Are you trying to be funny? No. What am I saying? Of course you do. I am seriously out of shape. I just sprinted the whole way here and, uh... Try and get to the point. Right. You know the corrupted footage from the train station? The distorted images that pointed us in the direction of Ark? What about it? There's a woman who works at Ruzika Station. Apparently, she's been trying to get in touch with Interpol. She says she has info on the security footage and wants to meet someone about it. Seems like something we should have known about earlier. What's Miller saying about this? Miller's not saying anything. Because I didn't talk to him about it. Yet. We keeping things from the bosses now, Chen? Only the ones who keep things from us. This woman, she... She sounded jumpy to me. If she knows who the bomber was... Jensen, something tells me you should try getting to her before anybody else does. Where is she? Waiting in the back alley on Stuhr Street. Her name is Pavla Kilmanovic. All right, I'll see what she knows. Pavla Kilmanovic? Sakura, you are augmented. I... I not think they sent... Yes. Yes, I am. You are with Interpol, yes? At the moment. I'm told you have information on the train station attack. Yes. No. Maybe. I... I work there. At Ruzika Station in surveillance room. I was not there when bombs blow up. And my shift did not start yet. But I am on my way, and when I hear explosions, I... I must go to see. To find out if my colleagues... There is so much devastation. I know. I was there. Take your time. It is horrible. Everything's so chaotic. When man from Tarvos arrive, it's hard for me to think straight. Tarvos? The private security company? He... He say he is part of investigation and I... I believe him. I give him code to Intellicam server room. I know maybe I should not, but he seems so like police, I think. You've done the right thing, coming forward with this. But I'd like to get a better sense of the time frame. How long after the explosions did this Tarvos man show up? Men? There were three of them. But only one go into server room. I... I cannot give you exact time. On one side, it feel like hours. On other, only minutes. Emergency people have been there some time, but police not start ordering every people around yet. Did anyone else see these men? No, no one else see, I think. I mean, no, no, I swear, no one else see them, just me. I, I... It's okay, we're just having a friendly conversation here. And if you're trying to protect someone, I can help. As long as you tell me everything. I... I'm not to protect no one. But I thought... I thought maybe I could help them. Who? Tarvos man give me credit chip when I see real police coming and I know he lie about who he is. He say it is enough credit to help many victims of bombings, many of my colleagues. So I take it. You took a bribe? Yes. But my colleagues not want help. They tell me to call Interpol. You will arrest me now? I'm with Interpol, not the police. And I'm hoping you'll remember more if I let you go. Really? You let me go? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Just be sure to call Interpol again if you think of anything else. As for Asian Chang. The one I spoke to before. Yes, I will. Thank you. Thank you. Chang, I spoke to Pavla Kilmanovic. Looks like someone from Tarvos got access to Ruzika's and Telecam servers before the police. Tarvos? Wh what? You think they corrupted it? Why? Uh, why would they do that, Jensen? I mean, I can't just call up Mr. Tarvos and ask, you know? Leave the asking to me. They have a regional office in Prague, right? Yeah, at Terminal Station. You need to take the metro to get there. 
I'll let you know what I find out. Oh, wait, Jensen. Terminal station is on lockdown. Reports for why haven't come in yet, but let me work my magic. There. Just gave you access to a train. You should be able to get there with no problem now. How did you get through the lockdown? No trains are supposed to stop here. I'm with Interpol. I need to speak with someone in the Tarvos offices. Well, I'm sorry, but there's a bomb scare going on outside. My lieutenant gave me strict orders not to let anyone through. You'll have to turn around or wait it out. Either way, I have a post to maintain. Nice work with the train, Chang, but we got another problem. The lockdown here is due to a bomb scare. We can't get into Tarbos until it's resolved. There is another way. I've been to that office before. They're in the middle of building an access area connected to the station. But if you use it... I'll be breaking into the offices of a security company. Think they'll thank me for identifying flaws in their defenses? <laughs> yeah, probably not. Especially if they're trying to cover up any involvement with Ark. I'll reconnect when I've reached their command center. Jensen out. Where's Longworth? Up in the moon. Still pretending to look busy. Yes, I'm coming.
So how's the range of movement? I love it, mate. You won't see a much better than the last one. They should. The seat's balance was completely reconfigured, and they tweaked the hand controls. Have a go around, won't you? Let's test mobility, mate. Jane, I'm at the command center. Good timing. Miss Kilmanovic called again. Said the Tarvos officer had a high-tech device on him. The kind you'd need a request email and a lieutenant's blessing to use. That means an order may have come from the top. I'll see what I can find out in the lieutenant's office. His name's Whitaker, and if I'm right, his office will be up on the mezzanine. <clears throat> Men, this is Lieutenant Whitaker. These are trying times. Local police are investigating something that may turn out to be a terrible problem. They claim everyone who wants their bare men is locked down. This means total commitment to Tarvos. Excellent. No good. And your fellow officers. And me. That is all. Carry on. Sure, there's a metro train available for me at terminal station. Did you find out who corrupted the footage? I did better than that. I'll fill you in on the details back at HQ. Number two. Yes, yes, yes. Of course. I'm sorry, sis. I've done absolutely everything in my power to keep you. Lieutenant Whitaker? I have to go. Something's come up.
Who are you? How did you get into my office? I'm with Interpol. We have reason to believe someone from Tarvo Security Services tampered with evidence of Ruzika Station shortly after the terrorist attack occurred. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Interpol? What the hell are you talking about? How dare you accuse Tarvos of collaborating with terrorists? It's not an accusation, Whitaker. It's a fact. Someone from this office corrupted the station's intellicam footage. And I'm pretty sure that someone was you. What? That is preposterous. Where, where would you get an idea like that? In an audio recording between you and your sister. They'll come for me! I can fix this. They've covered up things caught in camera before. What? Yeah, but they haven't accessed the station to telecom data yet. <laughs> I have to go. I have to do this now. Shall I continue? Or would you like to explain now? It, it's not what it looks like. I'm not a terrorist. I'm not an org sympathizer. And it wasn't a Tarvos mandate, or anything like that. I just... I... I had to protect my sister. Your sister? Your sister was the bomber? No, she would never! It was her husband. Ark got to him. He brainwashed him somehow. My brother-in-law was a proud man. He was a good mechanic. But after the incident, people didn't trust dogs around machinery. He lost his job. He and your sister would have been forced to move to Gollum City then. You sure he was a member of Ark? Well, isn't everyone in that place? I mean, you have to be if you want to survive. When he lost his license to work, he became bitter and resentful. Ark must have preyed on that. It's what terrorists do. It's what somebody did. I'm just not sure it was Ark. I need his name, Lieutenant. He's dead. But my sister isn't. You ID the bomber, and the next thing that happens is the police start tearing through Gollum City looking for her. So no, I'm not telling you his name. I get that you want to protect your sister, Lieutenant, and I even agree. Once the bomber's name gets out, she probably will be in danger. But I can help with that, if you give me the name. I swear to you, she had nothing to do with the attack. And my brother-in-law... Ivan was just a pawn. He, he couldn't organize anything if he tried. Burke. His name was Ivan Burke. That was a neat trick, the way you corrupted the IntelliCam data. Any chance it can be restored? No. The remote data transfer device I use is very efficient. There's no way to recover the original data. Has Tarvos tampered with footage like this in the past? <laughs> oh, I'm in enough trouble as it is, Agent. I'm not adding more by answering that. And your sister? If I'm gonna help her, I need her name too. Melissa. If you're serious about helping her, there are only two ways you can. Get her out of there. I'll keep Ivan's name out of it. I understand. Did your sister ever mention anyone else from Ark? Someone Ivan might have spent a lot of time with? You mean the one who recruited him? No, not specifically, no. There were a couple of guys he'd sometimes drink with. Uh, T-Bone, Lou Bosch... I don't know. Oh, but there was this one guy. He came by their apartment about a week ago. The big Russian. He left a note and signed it... Old blue eye? She said he seemed friendly enough, but was glad he didn't stay. I appreciate you coming clean, Lieutenant. Even so, I wouldn't leave town if I were you. You've made this investigation harder than it should have been. I have no intention of leaving. Why? What are you going to do now? I get that you acted to protect your sister, and that you're worried she'll be put at risk. I'll do my best to keep names out of my report for now. But I can't guarantee they won't be needed in the future. I see. I appreciate you giving me and my sister a chance, Agent. I'll make sure an officer is waiting at the lift. It'll take you down to the Metro level. Men, this is Lieutenant Whittaker. In the midst of our lockdown, an Interpol agent penetrated our defenses. 
We'll deal with the ramifications later. For now, show him to the lift so he can access the metro. Whittaker, out. Before you go, allow me to offer you uh, a token of my appreciation. Some whiskey, perhaps? The lift to the metro level is just outside the command center. Head through the doors on the far side of the command center. The lift is to the right. I don't have time to draw you a map. that'll get you to the metro level. Make Tarvos look bad again, and you and I are going to have words. You have yourself a pleasant evening, Agent. You were looking for each Well played, agent. Well played. I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Here quick. So let's have it, Jensen. Who's our bomber, and how the hell is Tarvos involved? The footage was corrupted by a Tarvos officer to protect the identity of a family member. Okay, so who is the bomber? The bomber doesn't matter. Someone within Ark is acting against Rucker's ideals. They recruited a nobody with very few options in life to be nothing more than a pawn in all this. Nice work, Jensen. You must have been quiet in there. Tarvos hasn't reported anything. I like to get answers without creating new questions. 